three, and um, today I'm gonna be with you for some, uh, just like some tips on how to keep your computer organized and clean. Um, please don't mind this or this or this. Sorry, I do like emphasize that because I'm downloading something. All right. Um, I have about I have like five or six tips for you guys. Um, to keep your computer organized and clean. All right. One of the tips is to get Rocket Bar because so a lot of times if you have a cluttered right here, if you have a cluttered desktop, you can't find anything, and a lot of times you have a background because you think it looks cool. And if you can't see your background, then what's the point of having a background if you don't can't see it or you don't can't don't like it? So um, only keep the things that can't be removed from in. All right, never mind. Um. First of all, if you're using the files, put the files put in Rocket Bar Doc are the things you use the most often. I use uh, a lot of the Adobe stuff, um, Camtasia, Firefox, and the internet a lot. So, I mean, don't like put something. I mean, on the desktop, sometimes you had files here, files all over the place, and just put programs. D I mean, if you have files, then make a document. And make a thing in my doc, make a folder called common stuff in your my documents, and then take that folder, like, um, and then drag it into Rocket Doc. See, it's as easy as that. And there you have your folder. Click on it, and there it goes. It pops up. Has all the stuff you need in it. That's a one simple thing. Um, another thing, if you download stuff a lot, then I suggest you keep a, f a file. A folder called My Downloads, and in the folder you put all the stuff you download in it. It's very easy and it's simple to, and it's just it organizes everything you need is in one folder, like Rocket Doc and the V Orb, which I don't have on right now, all need to be reactivated every time you log on. So, for instance, I have V Orb here, and I have Rocket Doc right up here in the stuff in this section. And if you s so see that you don't use something as much as you use other things, like I don't use Movie Maker as much now, you might as well just take it off the list. You go, remove from this list. And there, there it's gone from the list. Like, I'm going to take this off here. And there you have it. And now, now your thing's more clean. It only has the stuff that you use the most. See, now I just removed something there. And um, now I have more room for recently used stuff. Remove from list. Remove from list. Remove from list. Come on. I did for delete the shortcuts before you delete the file, or else it's gonna take forever to 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 load to bring up the. You know, just just do that. <laughs> Another thing, um, if you want to save space on your computer, empty your recycle bin. I mean, you deleted the stuff for a reason. If you're not going to keep in it anymore, what's the point of having... If you're going to keep it, what's the point of wasting space on your computer with the stuff you don't need? Um, another thing. Uh, every time at like the end of the month, clean out your computer. Save you tons of space. I mean, not every day you get another chip that has three more gigs of memory on it. Like, just the other day, I cleaned out my program files and got like seven... I literally added like two gigs of memory back to the C drive. And, um, just do, I mean, it's, it's just more helpful. It cleans out your computer more. Um, all right, that's it for today. I couldn't think of anything else to do today. So I'm bored, so I made this, guys, for you guys. All right, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Um, sorry for that. I mean, if there's one thing that one YouTube video say, like a YouTube video has a program in it that you're gonna keep going back to, like, don't keep the, f like, for example, if you wanna continuously go back to this video,
like say you want to keep going back to this video, then don't minimize it because that wastes memory space. I mean, if you get the f things you want from it and you want it just for reference, go like this and drag it, dra drag the URL back onto onto your desktop, and there you go. You just replaced. Now you have something to go to without having to waste memory. Um, by the way, memory is how fast your computer works when multiple things are up and stuff. So, what's the point of wasting your memory that you could be using on other stuff? With, you just can use this. Alright. Now that's it. I'll see you guys next time.